Archie here from OG Creations. Whether you're a believer in fact-based or conspiracy-based news, science or story time, you can't turn anywhere right now without hearing about UAPs or UFOs. So before a mothership attempts a landing to share their wisdom of time and space, I thought I would create a series of videos dedicated to vibrant, stunning photographs of some of the galaxies. Let me introduce you to my black hole hoodie. I'm starting by drawing a diagonal line from the shoulder to the lat on a Hanes 100% cotton black hoodie. Using the fan fold, I make smallish pleats and secure it with a rubber band. Um, a Rosetta Stone, if you will, it's, it's uh, an exemplar of most of the supermassive black holes in the universe. Using a combination of the geode and crumple techniques, I tie up the top of the hoodie using sinew and rubber bands to prepare it for a bleach bath. Place the bottom portion of the hoodie on one of my die racks and drop the top portion in a 2 to 1 bleach solution for 25 to 30 minutes. I then place it in a 10 to 1 water to peroxide solution for 20 minutes. Well, what I'll say very briefly on this is that um, about 300 light years from the center of the galaxy, they see these wisps of X-ray light and they think that what causes that is that 300 years ago I was excited to see what the pattern looked like after the bleaching, so I unwrapped the hoodie and was super excited. I almost left it exactly as it was. I loved that variance of the tan and burnt Santa combo that I got from the bleach. Once my imagination started working on the drawouts from that black area, I couldn't help but think of that blurred, stretched face of every person in every film that was sucked into a wormhole or a black hole. So deep space it was. I will be using a variety of purples to complete this one. I washed the hoodie in a cold water cycle and then placed it in a soda ash bath for 25 minutes and then let it rest on my dye racks until it was almost dry, about 24 hours. When I first started playing around with tie dye, I strictly focused on reverse dyeing garments and would paint them with a the dye meaning I would untie them and purposely place the dye in specific areas. Here in the lightest areas, I'm applying a light lavender liquid dye. I'll flip it over and apply the dye to the back as well.
Once that is fully saturated, I crumple up the hoodie and randomly apply shades of grape and dark purple to finish it up. entire galaxy. It is then set aside for 24 to 48 hours in a warmer space, somewhere about 65 and 70 degrees. 300 light years from the center of the galaxy, they see these wisps of X-ray light. And they think that what causes that is that 300 years ago there was a burst of activity in the center of our galaxy. It is rinsed in cold water and then ran through the laundry using a cold water cycle and then a hot water cycle. After being ironed, it's placed into inventory and added to my Etsy store, ready to purchase. 
You can order yours now by clicking the link above or by visiting ogcreationstore.etsy.com. Brilliant. I think Dr. Ellie Arroway would love it. Thank you for visiting. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and let me know in the comment section what you would like to see created next. Uh -huh.